I'm Dorothy the Organizer. Hi, and welcome to your holidays. You know, my job today is to help you figure out how to create sanity before, during, and after the holidays. And we can do this because, well, you need to think about how you value the holidays. And there are several ways you might look at it. Everybody has a different point of view, you know. One, you might be a person who loves to give gifts. Bows, wrap, gift giving, it's just a blast. Good for you. You might be a person who actually prefers to celebrate with the people. People, people means family, everybody, friends, parties. You might just enjoy that instead. You might also prefer special experiences like going to a parade, ice skating, or seeing the special lights. And finally, you may just want to focus on the actual holiday and its spiritual meaning to you. I've got several tips for you to organize yourself during the holidays, and I think the most important tip is to organize you. What do I mean? It means going through your calendar, looking up a date, and finding when you can actually spend time with yourself to do what you think is most important for you during the holidays. That's why we're here, to celebrate and enjoy, but you deserve to put yourself on the calendar first. Remember the old oxygen mask theory? Put yourself on, take care of you, and then take care of others. Now, a second tip is to remember that less is more. The less gifts you have to give, the less dollars you have to spend, the fewer decorations you have to put up, all means that you get more time for yourself and the things that you value during the holidays. Tip number three is, well, pick a theme. You can do something like having a red Christmas and make everything red. It's easy for decorating. Or maybe you want to do a handmade Hanukkah where everything you do is handmade and the gifts that you give are handmade. Maybe for your family you decide, we'll have an international holiday, and the foods that you have from all around the table are from all around the world. Whatever you decide, again, it's all about how you value the holidays. Now, what about afterwards? What are you gonna do? How will you organize yourself after the holidays are over? Number one tip here is to be sure to ask for help. That means get your kids, hire a college student, even a high school student, and pay them. Get the help so you don't have to do it yourself. And finally, when it comes to all the decorations that you're going to save so that you can keep them for next year, well, you can use a simple caddy and put everything right in here. Avoid perfection at all costs. Just put it in and it's all grouped together. Tape, extra boxes, whatever you need. Then, what do you do with that wrapping paper? Take a hanger. Take a garment bag. Oh, I love this one. And just put the rolls of paper right inside the garment bag. It keeps them upright. All you have to do is zip it up. Don't forget to put in the hanger. And get this, folks. This is the really cool part. Uh-huh. Finish zipping. Put it in the closet. Wow, it saves space, it keeps it all together. No wild, crazy gift wrap rolls hanging around anywhere. Good luck.